There are two ways to think about learning. A traditional perspective sees students as empty vessels. Students wait for the teacher to point out the facts and ideas they should collect in their jars. Students hold all the facts in their heads until they dump them out to prove they have retained them. But there's another way to look at learning. In concept-based learning, students begin not as empty vessels, but instead with their own pre-existing ideas, similar to a stone waiting to be sculpted. As we learn, we chisel away at our ideas until they become more sophisticated, clear, precise, complex, and accurate. At the end, we have a profound, well-thought-out idea of our own construction. In the second way of learning, the students are doing the work and benefiting from it, not the teacher. But how do you help students discover and refine these ideas? The secret is simple, just two words, uncover and transfer. To help students uncover an idea, start with an abstract question. If you're studying the concept of ecosystems, for example, we might start with a question like, what is the relationship between human actions and ecosystems? Have students share their initial thoughts. One might say, people can hurt the environment. That's a good start, but it's not complete. Now, investigate a specific context that illustrates that conceptual relationship. For example, deforestation in the Amazon. From this, students understand that human actions can directly devastate an ecosystem and contribute to the loss of certain species. Transfer is the next step of the process. Introduce a different example that will add a more nuanced understanding than they had before. For example, next you might investigate the effects humans have on oceans. Students will learn that human waste can end up in oceans and harm sea life, also threatening species. This is more of an indirect impact, adding even more nuance and complexity to their understanding. To assess students' understanding of the conceptual relationship, Let's transfer again to the Arctic Ocean and have students hypothesize about the impact of global temperatures. Throughout this process of uncovering conceptual relationships and transferring to new situations, students should start to recognize a pattern. Rather than seeing smaller individual ecosystems, students understand the Earth as an entire giant system where human actions may have a great impact. As you introduce more and more examples, students' understanding grows bigger, deeper, and more complex. This deep understanding of how the world works and the ability to transfer ideas to new contexts is an essential skill that allows students to become creators, problem solvers, and innovators.